I used to be Captain Europe. This is Captain Europe. Uh, my handle is now at Justice League EU. My handle is uh, Captain underscore Europe. The whole point of the Captain Europe gig, whether it was on Twitter or elsewhere, was to get the conversation going and yeah, maybe maybe influence it, get people thinking about the EU, hopefully in a, in a positive light, but also looking at uh, what we can change. Captain Europe is more of a concept, uh, like, like a way to, to make Europe more pop uh, and more popular. Um, but you know, it's, it's, it's more than about one person. So, um, so it's the idea, it's the embodiment and like an avatar of, of European values. <laughs> I think my two most popular social media posts was one sort of very long read on um, the EU's constitutional setup, and, uh, and the second most popular was, an, was a completely gratuitous picture of my bum um, at, a, at a charity event. So you know, it just shows the, the um, from the sublime to the, the to the, uh, to the ridiculous. Um, but no, I, on, a, on a more serious note, I have I have kind of converted uh, three Eurosceptics that I can think of. To, to think again, and uh, some of them have become my, my greatest allies. I can personally think of, of, of like a personal achievement since, since that year I, I'm wearing the cape. Uh, my very, like one of the very first posts I, I did were liked and uh, sometimes retweeted by commissioners. So as a, as a totally anonymous person, it kind of filled me with confidence. <laughs> Be yourself, be unique, be honest, and, uh, and be helpful. And I would add, um, yeah, do not um, be shy to defend Europe, because there is a silent majority that do not want this well, marvelous project to, to collapse.